Welcome to my room, my craft room. This is what's in the front, and this is the craft room. It's not the most organized one, but I know where everything is. I'm gonna start by showing you here. Uh, behind this closet door, I have um, a bunch of shoe racks that hold anything from punches to tapes and yarn and different odds and ends of things that I want cheesecloth and things like that. My husband recently made these shelves for me here and they just basically store any kind of extra stuff that I have that I need. You see all my fabric tag glues and all my foam tapes. I need these because um, I always buy them in the US because they're cheaper. So I stock up on everything. Then here I have my whole wall of spice racks. It has everything that is mixed media that I can use. Here is uh, color blooms and all the different uh, micro beads that I have. Here is my desk. Right here, this is a very bright light so I can do my projects and my Ustream videos or my regular videos. And I have a wall full of my art as inspiration. Here is my computer and I do connect it to the internet so I can do the, the Ustream shows. Here is a little Daisy Susan, I don't know, it's like a twirl thing that has all my, uh, some of my alphabets, some markers, and then I have one of these cool Ikea handy dandy things <laughs> that have the carts that hold all my mixed media. I have to see, you can have see all the Prima stuff. And I've hung from it, I've hung a bunch of baskets all around, different ones that I've found. Nothing really matches, but it's just good because I can put my paintbrushes and different things on it. As you move on, you can see I have this extra table here. I have my old Cricut machine and a, and a sewing machine. I have some more, more storage units for some other things at the bottom and some paper. And I also have underneath my desk a storage unit with more with more mixed media and stuff like that. As we go along, I have a standing twirl thing. That's where I hang all my masks. And I used to hang all, all papers there, but now I hang my masks and other odds and ends. As you can see, they're all kind of clipped on. This is a clip it machine. That's what it is. A clip it. Okay, and I have some extra racks here. I just put these recently. That's why they're so empty. Uh, there's still room for to grow and put more things on it. Here is more storage. Some flowers. I have this storage unit that I have more papers in. Not very organized, but my husband made some shelves on this IKEA unit. Then right here on the side, I have, this is the sign that, I'm, that made me when my, my kids made me when I made it to the Prima team. And right underneath is basically a bunch of products from Prima on a wall. I took this idea from Gabby Pollaco. I really liked it. And my dad and my, my husband put a um, pegboard. So it's really useful. And this is the desk. It used to be our office desk. I mean, my kids still use it for projects and stuff like that. My husband sometimes uses this. I have more storage unit right underneath the desk. There's a bin for my layouts and then some other un uh, some uh, another unit for other things. And some more of my paintings and artwork. And this unit is the last one. It's another shelf, bookshelf, and it has uh, some crates that ha hold some of my papers. And a bunch of baskets that are categorized by, like they're, they're prima flowers, categorized by flower, by color, categorized by type of flower, and so forth. And I have some odds and ends of different things. This shelves have, this sh these shelves over here hold some of my cardstock, some of my Blue Fern Studio chipboard, and seven dots papers. So I try to categorize the papers according to where I, um, according to the to the company that it is from that it's from and again i try to hang some more baskets these handy dandy baskets i 
I found them, they only sold in Home Depot in the US. I just recently found them, thanks to Delina who told me about them. I saw them in her craft room. And I basically hung, if you can see, I hung some of them on these, this wall too, on these racks too, and one over here. So everything is basically, there's some over there. So they're really good because I can hang a bunch of things, projects and things, and you can also kind of move them aside if you can't reach the back. So they were really great for that. Anyways, thank you for coming and visiting me in my room. Bye.